basically the idea for the human library came because we were a group of young people working together to um, overcome uh, intolerance and prejudice because we saw not only uh, amongst young people but also uh, amongst adults that there was a lot of prejudice between different groups both uh, ethnic groups, uh, religious groups, uh, youth cultures. So we saw uh, people supporting uh, different football clubs would end up fighting with each other instead of enjoying the sport that they have in common. So we saw this as a um, problem that sometimes led to violence but more often it just led to people not being given uh, dignity and respect because they maybe were disabled or uh, maybe had a um, certain ethnic background or certain preferences. So by having this uh, human library, it's a way to actually challenge your own uh, prejudice that you judge people unfairly. It's a chance to have a conversation um, and to actually, instead of reading a dead boring book, you have an exciting live interactive book where you can ask questions and you can read their life story. People in Malaysia are quite curious. You know, they like to try new food, they like to, you know, so if you can provide an exciting uh, menu that you can actually go and speak to someone here uh, who is maybe, um, th they use the word disabled, but we prefer the word different abled. They have different talents, different skills. Um, you can talk to someone who's been on death row, um, who's been pardoned, what was it like to be on death row and what does it take to turn your life around to become a contributing citizen rather than a criminal. So you can actually get some unique views into life that you couldn't normally get. So people are really uh, engaging and embracing this uh, very positively. Pertama memang uh, menjadi tugas akak lah actually kan. Uh, untuk advocate ataupun untuk mendewasakan masyarakat uh, tentang HIV actually that is my, my main point of uh, being here. It's very emotional when you actually talk to someone from that group that you may have strong views of everything they do wrong or they have different views than me in politics or in spiritually or something. Uh, when you actually meet someone and talk with them, you may not agree, but they become more human. Basically, the human library, we have uh, basically the books, which is the, uh, you can, the main product you can say on the shelf. Uh, then we have the librarians over here who will help enroll the readers. So they get a, just like you would in a library, you get the library card. Only with this can you take out books. And just like in a normal library, you know the rules. When you take out a book, what is it that librarian will always say? Return it in the same condition, you know? Oh, okay. So in the same thing here, you can read all you like, but don't abuse the book. Don't uh, try to tell them what they should do or disrespect them or something. Keep your views to yourself and just listen and be more open. Sometimes when we talk with other people, we're so busy with our own view of how they are different than us and they're wrong and sinful and, and so on and we don't listen because probably they're trying their best. <laughs>